Now we've finished almost everything with this particular project except one thing. We need to have the sample audio as a standard reference to be able to not send that audio back to the far end so that they would get an echo. So how you would do that is go back to our matrix view that we talked about earlier and you'll notice there's a tab at the top here it says reference matrix and when we hit this tab you will see a cheat sheet if you will that is kind of showing you what is the direct output in that room and again we're still in room A here what is the direct output that has all the audio that I don't want to send to the other end far end so that they'll get echo and nothing else that's the key word on this there's no sound reinforcement in this particular project all we're talking about is the audio coming from the far end that's coming out of this direct output which is a ceiling speakers so now that we see that and that's the key rule is what's the direct output that has all the audio and nothing else that is a standard reference so if that's the case we would then go to resources partitions go to the output which is a direct output and that's the ceiling speakers and add a standard reference when we add a standard reference we would then go to back to the reference matrix and now you'll see that there's the standard reference which is those speakers that output of that audio that you don't want to send back and since that's the sample audio I don't want to send it back through any open mics and since this is the handheld lavalier and beam forming mic I don't want to send it back through those individual mics so that the far end would get any echo and that's basically how you would set up a standard reference to make sure that you have no echo on the far end.